You have traveled east on Highway 14 into southern Minnesota. It's a landmark you'll likely recognize. Work at the Delmont plant in Sleepy Eye, Minnesota will soon come to an end. Bill Hudson reports. A cold October rain only adds to the somber mood of Sleepy Eye. When people think of Sleepy Eye, part of that is Del Monte. Just west of town, Del Monte's canning plant has been a fixture for 90 years. But in late August, its workforce of over 300 was told this season will be their last. Came as a complete surprise. Nobody was expecting it. Economic Development Director Kirk Kramer says there's still hope the plant will be sold to another company. Several have shown some interest. We're going to have to figure out what we, you know, what we can do with a facility that size. And I've had a, a number of inquiries by other businesses from around the state. But it's not just plant workers who are going to be feeling the pinch. Del Monte contracted with dozens of area farmers to supply the plant with its sweet corn and peas. So residents worry about the wider impacts. Still, the city's resiliency can be seen along Main Street, where a once shuttered theater has been renovated into a brewery and coffee shop. Owner Adam Armbruster hopes it's symbolic of what happens to Del Monte. Ironically, it just kind of happens at the same time that we're starting to open. Uh, I don't know if that's good or bad timing uh, necessarily, but um, it's it's something we kind of just we have to keep plugging along. And in a few weeks, corn piles will diminish and the final crop will be packed, like the jobs of so many left to wonder when their next paycheck will come.